I'm gonna break down how I created this lakeside house in Blender. I'll add a ground plane and import a house model, also making all the island features that I'm gonna need. Then importing a dirt texture that we're not gonna see anyways. Here I'm importing some trees from the Tree Machine add-on, which you can check out with the link in the description, and instancing them on the general mountain shape I placed in the background. Then I'll make a cube and make it cover the trees in order to add some localized fog that I'm gonna create using some noise and emission. For the lake, I'll use another noise texture to displace a glossy BSDF, which I later replace with a glass and volume absorption BSDF. Now onto the house that I imported in the very beginning. Um, I quite like the shape and general vibe of it, but in terms of quality, it's pretty lacking, starting with the roof, so here I'm trying to fix it. Also applying some new textures to these logs here, um, generally overhauling the whole thing. I'm also going to randomly vary the brightness of the textures and also use some noise texture to again vary the brightness but also the roughness of the materials. After a while I get frustrated with the roof and so I just remodeled the thing. I don't know what was wrong with the mesh but it was, I don't know, it was kind of unfixable for me. But yeah, here I'm also adding some displacement to it um, just to bring out that extra detail. I'm not sure if you see it. I also wanted to randomly vary the color of the trees in the background, so I did that here. Then touching up the shore by placing a few rock models, um, just duplicating them and uh, filling out the shore. Then also scattering more rocks on the island itself and just covering it in rocks. On top of that, I'll also add some grass, tweaking its color to be more orange because I want it to be a kind of autumn vibe. And also adding some shrubs and birch trees that I'll again put into autumn. I'm not happy with the lighting right now, so I tried around with a few different HGRIs, but ultimately decided on using the Nishita sky. Also adding some atmosphere slash fog. In compositing, I'll mix a blurred version of the image into itself. This is a trick I like to do quite often. And also adding some film emulation. I'm not happy with the detail of the rocks I added to the shore, so I'll scatter some more rocks and grass on them as well. I feel the lake is a bit too empty right now, so I want to add some floating leaves, um, concentrating them closer to the shore because I feel like that's where most of the leaves would be. Then animating the camera. I am going for kind of a Hitchcock zoom type of deal. Also adding some wind to the trees. Um, I'm not using the built-in tree machine wind because it's a little bit slower, so I'm making it myself. Other than that, uh, my brother mentioned um, I should maybe add some fog to the lake as well because I got it in the forest. Um, so I'm doing that here. First, I'm experimenting with fog cards. I didn't really like the look of that. Uh, maybe I just didn't add enough, so I just added a huge cube and uh, made it foggy. First with the mission, I didn't like that, so I made it a little bit taller and added a principled volume to it, which I preferred after I reduced the strength. But with that done, after adding a color grade, here is the final render. Thanks for watching.